We hear that at work sometimes, some of us, so we're a little shy about stepping up, standing up, saying anything. People look at us and say, why are you a Republican? We say, well, you know, my mom voted Republican, and I like Ronald Reagan. <laughs> I think he did a great job, and I like Reagan. And so I, that's why I'm a Republican. We shy away from the truth. We don't want to look at that person and say, you know, well, wasn't it the Republican Party that was formed to stand up for the Republic? Uh, not the democracy like you see displayed on the news every day. You see, them folks want a democracy. They want the mob to rule. They don't want this republic. And they don't re want Republicans standing up for the republic. You're going to tell them that, uh, yeah, wasn't it? Uh, well, they say, well, the Republican Party is the party of old white men. <laughs> it ain't coming off. And while we're on that subject, wasn't it the Republican Party that uh, fought a war to free the slaves? How many Jim Crow laws were passed by Republicans? Wasn't it the Republicans who ended Jim Crow? Then you can take it even further and say, oh, so you're a Democrat. Why are you a Democrat? You know the Democrats were the ones that were in favor of slavery. They were the ones in favor of the Confederacy. They were the ones that created Jim Crow. They are the ones that made the laws. And they are the ones that fought like hell to keep them. Until they found out a different way to enslave people. Instead of giving them welfare, instead of giving them slave shacks and slave shacks and shackles, they decided they were going to give them welfare checks at the ghetto. You see, there are truths that nobody wants to talk about. Not the news media. Not the college Excuse me, the college professors. I'm getting excited up here, guys. Not the college professors. Nobody wants the front row. Y'all better watch out, bro.